very best in Europe. was there waiting. He had almost conceded the point, but he got his racket in play. Now watch this and keep an eye on McEnroe's forehand. Out of position, he stands there and look at that. Just lays it in there. Be a much better player. Again, staying alive. Now he being up to beat. McEnroe serving first point of the seventh game. Oh, and there it is. The touch that we've all come to admire so much in this young man from New York. At the Rocus Club. Lendl moving so far around that shot on the forehand left a lot of court open. McEnroe using his great touch just drops a backhand volley into the open court. Yes, and watch this because you'll see it. You may just see it at the last minute. The wind actually takes the ball. the drop volley and turns his back to Lindo as if to say I've made the shot I don't think you're gonna get it unbelievable shot well he missed the forehand on the volley the first time but you watch him take the backhand this time it really is a, a great shot when it comes the touch the timing everything is just perfect look at that exactly <laughs> much new Lendl would go down the line for the passing shot now he has that great cross court Talk about unbelievable shots. McEnroe. Bite to the apple. You can yell at two people. You can argue with two different lines persons. Got him. McEnroe with the touch of a genius from that little drop shot off the left hand. He really disguises this well. Right there. Little underslice. And it dies. Lendl was stunned. And there's the touch of a maestro. You don't make a half volley shot like that. You can play for a lifetime and not make this shot. I watch your McEnroe just with the little half volley outstretched catching it perfectly. It's a tough one. He wasn't... Underspin off the backhand side. No. Just missed. Also because his strings are rather loose and because he has that very short backswing as we watch. Now look, not a big backswing, it's in the wrist. It's a flick of the wrist, like Hank Aaron, someone else. As another one. 
but he needs to put him away here. And he does. McEnroe, one game to love in. He likes the surface here in Sydney. Medium pace, quite good for serve volley tennis. Gran bel tennis. Gran bel tennis. Sono iscritti al torneo di Bruxelles che precede il Master. Oh mamma mia! Questa è una gran risposta. <ride> è una risposta grandissima. Guarda qui, guarda che roba. Poi, a due centimetri dalla riga. Guarda cosa gli ha fatto McEnroe. E gli è andata dentro, bel, beh, meritava perché era un ricamo tra i più belli. Bel circoletto rosso qui. Perché, e eh beh, guarda McEnroe, anche la palla corta che fu sconsigliata da questo terreno, ma nella circostanza efficace e poi il pallonetto al volo. Guarda, Assolutamente impresa. Anche lui a rete. Oh, eh. A rete, è il rovescio, non c'è bisogno di andare a rete quando si gioca una risposta di questo tipo. Guarda come l'ha anticipata, era proprio no, sì. dentro il campo di un paio di metri. Oh, splendido. Più elettrico. Yeah. Seemingly effortless. dropping the first set made a beautiful shot now watch how he does it the racket just drops down see he doesn't bend the knees he just drops the racket he was going to go to sensational style. Yes, he did. The uh, linesman to just leave the building. A surprising end as we go to the tiebreaker, and perhaps it should not be surprising. What a covering the net. Oh yes, spectacular play from McEnroe. That's vintage McEnroe there. He curls that ball around the net post. That ball was outside the line the whole way through until the end where he curls it in.